I'm on Brick Lane, surrounded by the buildings of the old Truman Brewery. Now, there's been a brewery on this site since at least the late 17th century. This is at the heart of historic Spitalfields. It is too important a site to be left simply to uh, the private owners at the moment. So, what the Spitalfields Trust has done to move things forward is hold an exhibition. The exhibition puts forward an idea of a master plan whether all the site is considered, again, for, for the public benefits it can offer, housing and workshops and open space. Um, also, the exhibition with a model will allow people, we hope, to participate, to engage, to give their views, let us know what they want. All this information should be fed into the development of a community-led master plan. My name's Louis Schultz. And my name's Shay Delican. And we're from Assemble, which is a design and architecture practice based in London. So we've uh, currently been doing an artist residency based in the building on 25 Princess Street. And we've been contacting different people in the area, looking at getting involved with different campaigns and local people fighting for uh, housing rights and land reform. You know, the Brick Lane area is hugely important. The Truman Brewery is a really important part of the area. Um, you know, historically it was the biggest employer and it forms this kind of enormous presence um, in Brick Lane. And I guess what we're trying to say is that whatever happens, whatever's the future of that, of that space, that, that huge space, um, should be a question for the community, the people that live and work in Brick Lane. My name is Sebastian Harding and I'm an artist. Spitalfields Trust approached me to ask me to create an artwork inspired by the Truman Brewery. One of the things that I wanted to do with this commission was create something that would be of interest both to people who are architecture enthusiasts but also to people who um, live in the area, who might know the buildings from having used them, having shopped in them. Um, so create something that kind of appeal to, to everyone really and made them think about this area which is so important. This site is privately owned and um, really it is too large to be developed privately for private profits. It is so important not just to Spitalfields and the people who live and work here but for London as a whole it has to be considered as a great public asset and developed for the public benefit. So the Trust is trying to evolve a community-led master plan. The first stage is to invite public participation, talking to people who live and work here, what do the people want, what do they need for this area to thrive, to continue being a very special part of London. What I say at, at stake here is the heart and soul of Spitalfields for the years to come. <laughs>